Hi, this is Ithier from BIMSER International, and in this video, you will learn about BIM and what can be achieved with the different modules of the product. Let's get started. BIM is an asset and maintenance management software that allows companies to manage their assets and the maintenance operations involved. Some of our clients have reported savings of 15 to 20 percent in terms of maintenance and up to 80 percent reduction in terms of failures. I will log into the demo environment with a username and password that belong to an admin user. I am accessing Beam via a web browser, but we also have a mobile application available for Android and iOS. The dashboard you see on the screen is customizable. For example, the manager could be interested in the different work orders created in the system or in the total maintenance cost calculated by adding the material, service, and labor costs. The pie charts show the number of work orders based on how many days they have been opened or the number of work orders that have been closed under 24 hours, a week, or a month. As you can see, we can show relevant information in different formats, cards, tables, graphs, and in real time. We can play around with the widgets and select the ones we want to see and rearrange the dashboard. The appearance of the main menu and the sections of it we can access are based on authorizations. We can create groups of users and grant them access based on the tasks they have to perform. This company in particular wants to leverage the complete functionality of Beam, and since I am an admin user, I have access to all the modules this company is using. The asset, maintenance, material, and personnel management modules constitute the core of Beam. Then we have optional modules, like the purchasing, energy, or after sales modules. Starting at the top, we see the asset management module, where we can manage all kinds of assets, machinery, vehicles, buildings, regardless of where they are located. The maintenance management section is where we take care of the different maintenance operations, whether they are periodic, preventive, or corrective actions. The material module allows companies to manage their inventory in real time. We can find out the optimal level of stock for each item or transfer spare parts between warehouses. If we are running low on a certain item, we can use the purchasing module to evaluate offers from different vendors and create a purchase order. The personnel management module is where we manage our resources and the tasks they complete. The energy management module allows companies, for example, to monitor the energy consumption. And finally, the after sales module helps them manage calls or appointments. At the bottom, you can find the system settings, which is where the configuration process starts. Thank you so much for watching. If you liked this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. If you want to learn more about Beam and the first step of the configuration process, which is the upload of the assets, make sure to watch this next video.